All right, so just to warm up, we'll take your arms up, reach them all the way up, and lift your hands up, look in between your hands, reach your arms up and back, so give yourself a little arch back, push your hips forward, you can keep your chin lifted, and look up in between your hands, and then reach over to the right side, so imagine that you're like holding a beach ball, keep your chin lifted, Go ahead, keep your fingertips activated to like push through your fingertips. Good. And then come back to the center. Shoulder blades together. Reach your arms up higher. Imagine you're pushing that beach ball onto the ceiling and then reach your arms to the left side. Peel open your right shoulder so you're lifting up on your chest. Push your hips to the right and release. Come back to the center. Beach ball goes all the way up to the ceiling and then imagine you're pushing the beach ball behind you. So you keep your chest lifted, but then there's a beach ball also behind you. So you don't want to drop that, but really lift as you push your hips forward. Good. And come back to the center and let your hands go down to your side and just twist. You can bring your hand, your elbows up. Good. And then reach your arms out wide and swing, whacking your back. Seven. That's not doing too good. What'd you say? That's not doing too good. Um, he had an appointment that was like scheduled for a while ago and they forgot she forgot about it. But yeah, he seems to be having a struggle. Having a tougher time. Here, hold on to that right wrist. Reach your arms up and then reach over. Yeah, but hopefully he'll get some more help and Adjust the medications. Good. And other side. Hold the left. Reach up and down over to the side. Good. And then reach your arms both straight up, separating your hands, and you're going to swing them down. So bring them up, then down. And you can kind of hinge forward as you swing them down. Good. All right. And then shoulder rolls. Bring your shoulders up, back, and down. Good. Interlace your hands. Place them behind your back. Pull your arms down and then tip forward. Let your hands come up. Good, and come back up to the center. Release your arms and roll your shoulders. Good, separate your feet, and you're just gonna rock to the left and the right. You can bring your hands to your hips, just sort of waking up your hips here. Peel your toes up as you shift your weight. Good, and then come to the center. Reach your hands up like you're holding the ball. Spin your toes out so that they're kind of pointing out. You're gonna bend your knees, squat down and up. But keep your legs as separate as you can, like as wide as you can. Good. Down and up. Down and then up. Good. Good. Now come down and hold and bring your hands to your heart. Squat those, your body down. Good. There you go. Legs separated, toes pointed out. And now in this position, just rock a little left and right. And as you rock, lift one heel and then the other. So come onto your toes as you, good. And lift, push your chest back. Good. And stay squatting down low, ground your feet, push your feet down, reach your arms up and then swing your right arm underneath your left. Eagle arms, still bend those knees. So, yep, there you go, and just try to maybe, good, there you go, and then you're gonna reach forward, like pull your upper body down. And now you can straighten those legs, pushing the back of the knees so you feel that back of your legs stretch. Good, and come back up, bend your knees, release your arms, Lift your arms up and swing the left arm underneath the right. Wrapping your arms like ropes. There you go. 
Good job, and then, yay, there you go, grab the bracelet. And then come down, straighten your legs out, push your knees back. Good, and come back up, lifting your upper body. Good, and reach your arms up, straighten your legs. And bring your arms down, bring your feet back together. Good. Now just bring one leg up and then the other. Just alternate left and right. Bring your arms up. Good. And then start tapping across. And then tap the elbow. Still keeping the other arm lifted. So it doesn't actually reach, the knee doesn't have to reach the elbow. Good. Just sort of towards that direction. Yep, keep going. 10 more. 10, nine. Lift the elbows back up in between. All right, you got it. There you go. Good. Good, and really shake it out. Okay, now I want you to sidestep, sidestep off the, all the way over, sidestep left, right, left, right, sidestep all the way over, and then sidestep all the way towards the window the other way. Good. Now as you sidestep, add jab, cross, jab, cross. So sidestep, jab, cross, jab, cross, all the way over. Good, keep going and back, jab, cross, jab, cross. Good. Now grapevine with one foot in front of the other and then back. So side step and then foot in front, side step, foot and back. Go all the way over. And then come all the way back, great binding back, left or like on top and then behind. Good, one more time there and back. Good. And come back to the center. Bring your hands up again, and you're gonna go across ten times. Mm -hmm. Good. Ten more each set. Good. Good. All right, reach your legs apart. Bend your, bend your left knee. So let your left knee bend and point your left toes towards the left side. Good, so you're gonna bend that left knee. Give yourself a little bounce here. Good, now reach your arms straight out. It's like warrior two. Rotate your hands back toward, up to the ceiling, and then open them back up. Good, keep that left knee bent. Again, rotate the hands, and bring it back up. Two more, rotate, and up, and rotate, and up. 
Bring your right hand to your back of your right leg. Reach your left arm up towards the ceiling. Keep your left knee bent, Jack. So bend that left knee, reach your left arm up to the ceiling. And now bring that left hand behind your head and twist your chest open more to the ceiling. So push your head against your hands, lift your chest, good, and release. Bring your left arm down to your left leg, reach your right arm up and twist, look towards your right hand up to the ceiling. So rest that, rest your left forearm on your left thigh. So it's all the way down. Yeah. And now bring your right hand behind your head, lift your chest, push your head against your hands. Good. And release. Come back up. And bring your feet back together. Toes pointing towards me. Take a deep breath in. Reach your arms up. Exhale, bring your hands to touch each other, slide them all the way down, bend your knees, tap your hands to, your, to the floor, and then come all the way back up again. Good. Separate your legs and spin your right toes out to the right side and bend your right knee. So right toes point that way, left toes point towards me. Good. And bounce here, give yourself a little bounce here, bending your right knee. Good. Reach your arms out. Warrior two. Stretch your arms. Imagine you're getting pulled by two like leashes of dogs. Good. Holding here. And then bring your left hand to your back leg. Reach your right arm up and look up at your right arm. Keep your right knee bent. Now bring your right hand against the back of your head and push your head into your hand. So lift your chest. Bend your right knee and create like an arch with your body, like a half, half moon shape. So Push the, lift your right shoulder up, left shoulder down. Good, and come back to the center. Bring your arms back out, keep your legs separated. Right toes pointed towards that right window. So still in that warrior two position, there you go. Now bring your uh, right hand down, bring your left arm up first. Reach it up first, twist so that you're Good, and then bring your left hand behind your head. Lift your chin, push your head against your hands. And just notice your breath. Push down on your feet. Good, and release, come back up. Bring your feet together, good. Shake your hips out, Make give yourself hip circles here. And the other way. Good, inhale, reach your arms up. And exhale, bring them down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sweep your arms out and up. Exhale, hands at heart center. All right, Jackie, yeah. get on down to the floor. Hit the ground. Uh-huh. The ground. <laughs> All right, so come to your hands and knees. Let me make sure this is right. Good, and we're just gonna do some cat cows. So drop your chin to your chest, lift your spine up. So tuck your chin, keep your arms straight. So yeah, straighten your arms as much as you can. There you go. And then lift your chest and look up, lift your butt up. Good, again, keep your arms straight, tuck your chin. 
Good, and then reverse cow. Push your hands through your, into the ground. Push the world away from you, good. And release, come back to the tabletop position and make circles with your hips. And go the other way. Good, all right, now bring your knees back a bit. We're gonna do 10 push-ups. We're gonna do lots of sets of push-ups, okay? So push your knees back, but now push your shoulders above your hands so that your shoulders are stacked above your hands. Your arms are as straight as you can bring them. Good. All right, we're gonna do 10. Go down and up, elbows in. One, and up, two, and up, three, four, good, five, six, seven, eight, nine, good, 10, take a rest here, push your hips back, walk your arms up, good, let your chest come towards the floor, and come back up. Come to all fours. And now you're gonna come down and just hold for 10 seconds. So come down halfway and just hold. There you go, hold, I'm on the timer. Good, hold, keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, one, and release. Now come onto your knees. So you're just on your knees and Shake your shoulders out. So roll your shoulders up, back, and down. Good. Bring your right leg forward, coming into a lunge. Bring your left hand down to the ground. Good. Tuck your left toes. Lift your left knee up. So you can bring your hands both down to the ground, actually. Good. And now hold here, just give yourself a little rock forward and back as much as you can. Good, and drop that left knee. Keep your left hand on the ground, but reach your right arm up and twist. And bring your right hand behind you onto your back and let yourself twist even more. You can, your right foot can peel up off the ground. Good. And release, bring both hands down to the ground in front of you, drop your upper body. Keep your leg, right leg there, coming into lizard. So let your elbows bend, relax your head, bring your head down, and shake your head left and right. and release. Now walk your right foot back behind. Good, and make circles with your hips. Notice how you might feel a little different. Actually, Jack, you can drop your belly down and arch your back, so a little upper facing dog. So you can drop your belly down, but keep your arms straight. So come down even further. Try to put, like, uh, drop your upper, uh, drop your lower body down. So it's almost like you're. Like your lower body. Yeah, you might go all. You know, go just go all. Come all the way down to your belly, Jack. Come all the way. What'd you say? Never get up. Oh, you'll get up. All right. Onto the belly. So now take your hands, place them underneath your shoulder. Elbows into your rib cage. Push the tops of your feet onto the floor. Look up and lift up using your back muscles. Try to get your chest off the floor. 
Push your chest through your shoulders. So you're reaching your chest forward and up. Hold. You might get a cramp in your leg. Lift, hold, and release. Come down. You can shake your hips out left and right. Good. Now come back to the center. Reach your arms straight out in front of you. Activate your right arm, relax your left arm. And now you're gonna reach your right arm up and forward and lift your left leg up and push it back. Good, keep holding. And release, come down. Activate your left arm, lift your left arm up, lift your right leg up and back. So lift your left arm up Reach it forward, lift your right leg up and push it back, hold, two, one, and release, bring it down. Shake your hips out left and right, and then plant your hands underneath your shoulder, and push yourself up, back to being on all fours. So come back to that push-up position. All right, we're gonna do 10 more, another set. This time, try to pull your hands in a little closer so it's a little bit more challenging. Get the triceps, okay, and begin. You're gonna come down and up. One, two, three, four. What'd you say? Yeah, it does. Six, seven, eight, nine. You got it, Jack. One more. Ten. Woo! There you go. All right, walk your hands back towards your knees and bring yourself to your knees and then bring your left leg forward for a lunge. Good. You could bring both hands down to the ground, tuck your right toes, lift your right knee and give yourself a little rock forward and back. That's, yeah, you can do it like that. Just do it for like that for now, Jack. Just go rock forward and back there. Good. And then bring your right hand to the ground, flat. Reach your left arm up. And twist. Good. And release that left hand back down. Toe heel. Bring your left foot up. Stretch your toes back. Stretching the back of your left leg. Good, and then bring that left foot over to the side and come into lizard. Bringing your arms and your upper body down. Oh, keep that left leg up, just over to the side. There you go. And bring your upper body down. Shake your head out left and right. Good, hold here for five breaths. Good, all right, bring the left leg back. Good, all right, now, yep, straighten it back, shake it out a little bit. And then bring your hands farther apart. We're doing one more set of the push-ups with your arms farther apart. So you have plenty of, yeah, there you go. Bring your knees back a bit and then we're gonna go down and up. Do as many as you can do, up and down. 
Hmm. See if you can get to 10. Okay, we'll rest on that one. I don't want you to drop down. All right, that's good, Jack. All right, come on down to your, uh, come on, spin around to come to take a seat, but you're not gonna lay back yet. Just take a seat on the floor. Yeah. All right, good. All right. Awesome. Now you can have your hands on the floor so you feel like supported here. Good, and then just let your ear drop down to your shoulder. And then the other side. Good, and then bring your chin to your chest and roll it to the left and to the right. Good, and then push yourself to lean forward now. So you're gonna push your hand, push away from your the floor, but lean forward. Try to tip your upper body forward. Good, and come back to the center. Can you pull your knees in so that your feet, the bottoms of your feet are touching, but your knees are out to the side? Good, and then just flap your knees so that your knees open and close, your hips open and close. Drop your knees down as far as you can bring them. Good, and then plant your feet back onto the ground. Push your hands into the ground, lift your chest up so that you're not sinking through, good. Tilt your weight back and then you're gonna lift one leg up. Good. Tap the foot down, lift the other leg up. Good, and try to do, hold less on your hands and use your core for this. You're gonna alternate, bringing a foot up and down, up and down. Good, keep going, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, good, all right, come back. T bend your knees tight enough into your um, body so that you can grab hold of the, your, underneath your sneakers or your ankles. Good, so hold on to there and then slide your upper body down so you're gonna lean forward and pull your legs so that you feel that stretch on your back, right? Yes. And you can straighten your legs too as much as you can. Mm -hmm. Good, keep pulling those legs so that your back really stretches. Good, and come back to the center. All right, now you're gonna slowly bring yourself onto your back. Good, bend your knees and rock them left and right. Good, and then hug your knees into your chest and squeeze. Rocking left and right. Good. Interlace your hands and put them behind your head. Stretch your legs straight up to the ceiling. And then bring your right leg down and back up. 
Left leg down and back up, alternating left and right. Try to keep that opposite leg straight up towards the ceiling. There you go, so there's one down. So now bring both legs straight up. And here you can bring your hands to the floor. Maybe that'll give you more resistance. So bring your hands to the floor, keep the legs up high. Good, we'll just do five on each side. Bring your left leg down, keep your right leg pointing to the ceiling. Good, and then bring the left leg up. And the right leg comes down. Does that feel like it's working your core, Jack? Yeah, it does, it's good. Yeah, okay. Keeping your lower back pushed to the floor. Let's do more of these. Because these are a little easier. Good. Opposite. Last five. Four. Three. Two. One. Good. Now interlace your hands behind your head. Lift your chest up, shoulders off the ground, and just hold for 10 seconds. Elbows out. So lift your upper body up and just hold. Holding there. And then pulse. Keep your shoulders off the ground the whole time, but pulse up and down. So up and down, up and down up and down. Keep your hips down and shoulders come up and down. Elbows out. Use your core so your core should be shaking by now. Upper body comes up and down. Try to bring your elbows as close to your knees as you can even though it's just it's not going to touch. Yeah there you go. Last ten. Nine. You got it. Seven. Six, five, get ready to hold. Four, three, two, one, and hold. Elbows out, keep your chin lifted. Elbows out, keep your chin lifted. Shoulders off the ground, keep holding. For three, two, one, and release. Does that burn, Jack? Yeah. A lot or a little? Okay. What'd you say? It's more like doing a push up. It would be easier to do an actual push up. Okay. Push up. Yeah, push ups are hard. Okay, bring your left leg to cross over your right leg. And then pull your knees into your chest. So slide your hands around your right leg or, or your left if that's better. But you want to lift your legs and pull your legs towards you. So you really feel that in the left hip. So even your right, yeah, there you go. Hold. And then release your legs down and twist to the right side. So keep your legs crossed and twist that jumble of legs to the right side. You can let your left arm come to the side, to the floor. Good. And let those legs drop to the right side. Good. And come back to the center. Unlace your legs and kick them. Kick them like kick your butt. So lift your legs up and just kick like flutter kick. So alternate left and right, left and right. Good, and then bring your left leg down. Bring your right leg up and over. Good, and now pull the knees in towards your chest and pull. Pull, pull, pull. 
and then release, drop your legs to the left side. Take your right arm down to the floor, left hand pulls those legs over. And release, come back to the center. Unlace your legs and then kick them, flutter kick them. So I kick your butt, yeah. There you go. And hug your knees into your chest, squeeze, hold. And now interlace your hands behind your head. Keep your knees tight. And you're gonna now roll up to touch your elbows to your knees. Good, come up and down. There you go, up and down. You can just keep your legs where they are and pull them closer when you get up to your elbow. Keep going. 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. And then drop your knees to the left and to the right. Good. Now lift your legs up, hold on to your calves. So this is called happy baby. So go ahead and grab hold of the, like your calves. Yeah, there you go. And you can go from the inside, Jack. So your arms on the outside, move them to the inside. Grab hold. Reach up and try to grab towards your ankles if you can, or like your pants, just sweet. Yeah, like the parts of your pants, like hook your, Middle finger right, good. And then rock left and right. Rock left and right, good. And then release your legs all the way down. And then close your eyes. Let your whole body relax, let your legs come out. Take a deep breath in, and then exhale it all out. Nope, he's still alive. He's just in Shavasanas. Deep breath in, Jack, and then let it go. <laughs> Deep breath in. Exhale it out. And then wiggle your toes in your sneakers. Reach your arms up over your head back behind you, then bend your knees and pull your knees into your chest, give your knees a big squeeze. Rock yourself left and right. Good, rock yourself up to a seated position. Take a deep breath in. 
let it go. Think about one sort of energy that you want to have for the rest of the day, or one sort, one feeling. 